Hi, this is Goran with Hometown Real Estate. I wanted to get this case study out to you of a foreclosure that was bought back in February the 18th of 2011 um, for 52000 bought for cash, uh, 2033 North LeClaire Avenue. It's around Grand and Armitage. Three bedroom, two bath home, frame home. Take a look at what it used to look like here. You know, the floors definitely needed to be done. Walls were in not horrible shape, but I mean, they needed to be skim coated or worked on. Bathrooms, of course, need to be redone. The kitchen. All in all, I mean, the home wasn't in really bad shape, just outdated. What ended up happening was this guy sold it for 181. Six months later, on eight um, August 31st, 2011, sold. So from sold to sold 218 to 831. So just over six months later, sold for 130 grand more. Um, they did pay five thousand dollars to the buyer, so technically it sold for one seventy six. The good thing here is it listed six twenty four. So four months later, it took this guy four months to do the work that I'm going to show you that he did in here. Um, four months later, it took him nineteen days to get a contract. He got a contract on July the eleventh and closed, like I said, August 31st, a month and a half later. Uh, what he did, end, <clears throat> excuse me, what he did end up doing was adding a bathroom, which is typical of all these flips. Um, the basement is redone, completely remodeled, and, or refinished, and a bathroom is added into the basement. We'll take a look here. Here is what he did in the kitchen. 42 inch maple cabinets, you know, granite counters, Glass tile, backsplash, stainless steel appliances. I mean, the cabinets are not the most expensive. I mean, they're cherry finish, but I mean, nothing outrageous. Floors were refinished, walls were redone. Um, you know, recessed lighting was added. I don't know by the photos here if the windows were done. I don't think they were from the exterior photos. But, uh, you know, doors were added, staircase, of course, all this is work that would be typical. Um, the steam unit, you know, the shower body uh, unit was installed in, it looks like, both bathrooms. I don't know, yeah, this bathroom and this bathroom. I mean, those are expensive units, but not hard to install. The appliances, like I said, were stainless steel. You know, new washer dryer, basement. Here's a remodeled basement. I mean, nothing really fancy, but you know, you're talking 130 difference. I honestly don't see more than 70 put in. Let's say 76, you're still left with 100. It was bought for 52. You know, you're looking at 50, 50,000 for four months of work. Uh, I wanted to get this one out to you, and uh, hopefully uh, this will help you uh, realize the potential that's out there. Talk to you soon. Thanks. Hi, it's Goran with Hometown Real Estate with another foreclosure case study for you. Uh, this one's located at 7629 West Forest Preserve in Chicago, um, Forest Preserve west of Harlem. Uh, this property was purchased for 70000 March 11th of this year for cash. Take a look at the inside. It's an older home. Uh, it was a pretty beat up condition. And we'll see here what they ended up doing and selling it for. 
Um, sold it for 191 September the 19th, so last week. Um, so from March to September, six months later, 191,000. Um, so 120 is your difference. Uh, they listed it July 1st and had a contract a month later, July 31st. Let's see what was done here. Nice shiny new floors, walls, patio doors opening up to a nice new deck, kitchen, cabinets up to the ceiling with crown moldings, granite counters, no backsplash, appliances of course stainless steel, bathroom, second bathroom, Basically a total rehab, but nothing again too fancy. Nice little deck. But again, it sold for 120 gram more. Four months uh, it took from August to July to get it listed. So they worked on it for four months. This house doesn't have a basement. I did want to point that out. Uh, I know a lot of people try and avoid homes without a basement, but I mean, there's potential here, as you can see on this one. You know, 67, say 70 grand, you still have 50 grand profit on this one, too. So, just want to get this one out to you also. And uh, keep on a lookout. Uh, I'll be doing more of these. Hi, it's Gordon again with Hometown Real Estate with a, another foreclosure case study for you. Um, this one was located at or is located at 2254 North Nagel in Chicago, 60707. Uh, Narragansett, just south of Grand. Um, bought for 75600 Three bedroom, one bath home. Nice little brick ranch. Paid for by cash. Um, take a look at here what it looked like before. Basically an outdated home. This here is the basement. So we'll take a look. This one, like I said, was bought in, or actually was bought December 30th, 2010. And sold August 30, 31st, 2011. So this one took nine months. Uh, sold for 192. We'll take a look at what was done on this one. No points were paid. It's a real nice uh, remodel on this one. They staged the property, which should, uh, of course, help sell faster. A nice attention to detail here with uh, some trim work, make it look like a wainscoting. Floors redone. Um, the kitchen. I mean, this is a great. dark finished cabinets with a light limestone top you know you got your glass tile um, travertine flooring I mean this is real nice here's your bathroom same travertine tile in the, in the shower only just a regular cast iron tub you know the dark floors here's your basement Ceramic tile, drywall, recessed lighting. You know, the key to this one is it was staged. I mean, this looks looks like a hotel. Here's your basement bathroom. Sold for 
So this property actually was on the market for six days. Um, listed July 21st, they had a contract on the 25th. And um, you know, that definitely, the staging had to do with that. Yeah, it probably cost these guys, you know, six, seven grand to stage it. But, you know, to get a contract in six days, I, I, th I think it's worth it. Um, so 192 and we said it was bought for 75 you know you've got a hundred just about a hundred twenty thousand dollars there for this small of a home um, definitely no work was done on the outside on this one again this one was at 2254 Nagel 120,000 difference um, you know, even if this one was seventy thousand put into it, you're looking at fifty grand profit again. Uh, that's uh, number three, and I probably won't be doing more of these till next month. But I just wanted to get these three out to you quickly, and hopefully, uh, like I said, it'll show what potential is out there with these uh, foreclosure properties. Thanks. Hi, hey, it's Gordon again with Hometown Real Estate. I was going to do only three, but I had to get this uh, foreclosure case study out to you. Um, just to, This one was just too good to not do. Um, this one was bought in March, March 16, 2011 for 98000 Take a look what it looked like here. Forty-nine forty-four West Warwick Avenue. So you're looking at uh, Irving and Irving and uh, Laramie, or I'm um, sorry, Irving and uh, Cicero. It sold for two fifty-nine nine beginning of this month September 9th so from March 16th so less than six months later uh, market time of one day uh, this house was listed and uh, had a contract same day and it took just about a month to close so end of uh, July first week of September so about six weeks to close let's take a look at what was done I mean this one was done real nice beautiful kitchen again with dark cabinets and the light countertops stainless steel appliances And of course the outside was repainted from that gray, this dark gray color to lighten it up to this nice cream off-white type color. But again, that's a difference of, uh, you know, $160,000. So, and it listed end of July. So it took them almost five months to do the work. Five months to do the work. And like I said, it sold in one day and closed a month later for a difference of uh, $160,000. That's uh, in Portage Park, 4944 West Warwick.